it's going to make you guys, I know, it always makes you all say yes to that. Um, okay, Elsa, I'm super excited to actually hop on and share with you um, and just the things that I have taught Carly and just the things that you need to know to um, get your business up and running. And you're like, how do I sign Perks members and how do I sign distributors? And so we're just going to go through all of that. And I want you to like, stop me if you're like, wait, can you show me that? Or can you say that again? Or whatever it is, because truly this is literally how all of us learn this. So um, just like a little bit about myself, I started this and I was a brand new mom. I have three kiddos now. Um, and when I started, I was, I work as a nurse and I really truly started. Cause I was like, you know what? I was like, nursing doesn't offer bonuses. Like, I don't really want to have to always work extra. I don't want to be burnt out, all that kind of stuff. And so when I was wanting to use the products anyway, so I got started it, that was like 11 and a half years ago. So I'm kind of aging myself, but it's been a long time. So, but I started right where you guys were. And really, I just remember thinking like, okay, can you like really make money with these things? And I was like, how do you make money? And then I was like nervous to, you know, what if you don't make money, that type of stuff. But I want to tell you that truly um the comp plan that we have here and how it pays you you can add an extra five paydays to your month so whatever you're doing now i don't know if you work right now or not if you if you don't you're gonna be like this is actually awesome because i can set my own hours um i told carly all the time i'm like if i could have had this in college while going to nursing school like it would have been a godsend to me because I instead I was like closing down, you know, a restaurant at 2 a.m. and then hop into clinicals at five. It was just kind of a little crazy, but we made it through. Um, but I started this and, you know, just a little bit into it. I just, it started making more money than my nursing job. And as things changed at the hospital or life changed, it was like, I was able to kind of shift and do what I wanted with it. But what I want you to know the most, um, and while we talk tonight, I want you to think to yourself, like, ask yourself, what did you start for? And you may already know that you may be like, I know exactly how much money I want to make each month, you know? Um, but I really want you to hone in on that number and not because money's everything, but money allows for a lot of things. Right. And the truth is, is that more than likely, whatever that number is for you, Elsa, you can probably make that in weekly bonuses. And so, and that's one of my biggest thing for you girls is just teaching you how to get that first foreign a friend right off the bat because once you know how to do that we literally just repeat it over and over and over again and I was telling Carly the same thing like what I teach you girls to do now is still what I do 11 and a half years later and it turned right like my plan b or what was going to be like a fun hobby or whatever you want to call it into a full-time career so really you guys can do whatever you want with it but I want you to know like the sky's the limit so play big like, this is not, like, I tell people all the time, I'm like, there is literally no goal too big. So if you're like, I want $1,100 a month, I literally can be like, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. And that is honestly one of the things I love about this business. So tell me first, like, which social media platforms do you have? Um, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok. Like all of them. Yeah. Yeah. And, and do you use more some of them more than others like what are you what like if you were to list those in order which ones do you use the most um I think I use Snapchat the most but I don't I think I post on Instagram more I'm yeah. I more have Facebook for like a, a lot of like our sports pictures are on there okay that kind of stuff too but like I have a ton of family on Facebook so like if I did post I know I have a lot of people on there too and I post I think I said like one of the things Carly was saying the other day I think I posted one of them on there too and stuff like that but I think I post the most on Instagram on Instagram okay no and I just like to know like where you guys are at um I don't use Snapchat a lot Carly you use Snapchat and you actually do awesome with that because you are very good at like eyes and ears open and she's like pops into a message box really quickly and so one thing I want you to know too is like use the crap out of us like I told Carly that too. I'm like, I expect you guys to be asking questions every single day. Like I asked questions all the time, but you want to know what? I was somebody that was building this business and it is how I learned. You learn by doing. So I think sometimes people are like, I have to know everything before I get started. In all reality, you just kind of have to jump in. And as you start mm -hmm. getting 
like conversations going, you're going to be like, Hey, Carly and Sarah, like, help me. What do, what do I say to this? Or what would you suggest for this person? And that's truly like how you learn to have the conversations and how you learn to gear conversations and also how you learn about the products. So know that like we all, even though you kind of start for yourself, you have a huge support system in teaching you how to do this. Okay. So, um, here are the things like, and I don't know if you had one of the questions that are in there, but I'm just going to kind of go over some things for you first. When did you join? What was your month? Did you uh, join last month? She joined I, when, right when we got back from Dallas. Oh, yeah. So, so new. Okay. Mm -hmm. so this yeah. is Brand really new. new. She's a baby. I love it. Mm -hmm. I love it. Because you want to know what? You, you have so many weekly paydays and bonuses that you can earn. So we want, I'm going to show you tonight how to like, maximize the crap out of that. I remember that was like the first thing I told Carly this too. And I'm like, and I want you to know that whatever we're teaching, even you tonight and what you do, literally Elsa, that's like what you do with the next person that joins with, with you or starts on your team or whatever. Like you literally just take them and show them exactly what you're doing. So it's not super, super hard. I think sometimes we overthink it, but I'm going to kind of go through all the things with you. But first I'm going to show you, I want to show you what the quick start program, what it looks like. Okay. Because this is literally what we do over and over. I'm just going to grab it one second and then I'm going to screen share with you. If I can find this little thing, hold on. Give me one sec. And, and do you have anything printed out? Um, I don't have anything. Printed out. Okay. We're going to get you to print some stuff out. So this stuff that I, that we talk over on tonight, I'm going to make sure that you have it and you can print it out because I'm huge. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm big on that, but look at this. Like I've been in for 11 and a half years. This is y'all's businesses. So um, I know that you already have Shay's under you, which she was going to be on tonight, but she's not. But you will end up like meeting your girls. Like even though you don't maybe, wait, do you know Shay? Yeah. You do, yeah. Okay, so you do know each I know other. Brooke too, but. Yes, okay, yeah. so you do know some of your people, which is awesome, but you guys are also going to enroll people that you don't know or that people place or whatever, and you're going to get to know people. Like, that's honestly one of the coolest things about this business is, like, you, you'll, you're you going to meet some of the best people. Carly can already attest to that. Like, she just showed up with us and didn't know anybody <laughs> except for me, and she's like, that was freaking awesome. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen really quick, but I can see you. I can answer your questions. I can see the chat, but because it's just stuff, like, just, just ask a question, like, just shout it out when you have it. Okay. Let me see if okay. oh, this little guy is going to move for me. Here we go. Okay. So here, this is something that you can print off. And I want you to print this off because this literally breaks down everything for you. Okay. And it's going to like show you exactly. So a perks member, the, that's what PM stands for. That's somebody else that is ordering products from your website at your discount. Okay. So any single person that you're helping, you guys, I'm sorry, I don't know how to stop those freaking pop-ups, but so when you see them, just hold with me. Um, but they will order off your website and whatever they're ordering gets shipped directly to them. But what's cool is honestly, we are one of the only companies that offers our customers the pricing that we get as distributors. So they get 25% off all the products that are on the website. They can mix and match whatever products they want. Um, and Carly probably already shared this with you. There's multiple ways. Your goal though, and what you want to focus on is getting people started to where they are going to order for three consecutive months. Okay. With that, there's no membership fee. Um, they can literally change what they get. So if they're like, Hey, you know, Elsa, they start with the hairline and they get the whole thing. And they're like, Hey, I only need the gummies and the, maybe the collagen the next month. They can do that. So there's no minimum or maximum of what they spend. But what that's going to do for you is it's going to pay you more, but it's also going to get them better results. And so one thing that I learned in the beginning was the more products you can get people started on, the faster they see results. And so you guys, they would truly rather spend a little bit more money. So I'm going to teach you tonight too, like you want to start with like a line, a, like a product line. And then if they're like, hey, that's a little bit out of my budget, totally fine. Then you can like kind of bop people down and be like, well, just start with the Root Revival Duo. Or you can just start with just this or whatever it is. So it doesn't matter what they spend, okay? So that's what uh -huh. a member is. And so this is what that stands for. This is the PM. So your goal, your first goal. So when we get off tonight, your goal is to get four perks members, okay? 
wow, you guys, this is probably because my computer is not updated. Um, and so as you enroll them, you're going to write them on your little sheet and then it adds up the BV. This part of it, so when we say BV, like every product has a volume associated to it, right? So it's like if you get um, the Root Revival, do it might be like 60 some BV or um, when they get the whole hair care line, it's 100 BV, okay? So that's kind of a good one. So if you honed in on, on like the hair care line, you're like, I'm gonna focus on that for a little bit. Um, you know that if each of these Perks members gets the hair care line, that's 100 BV, 100, 100, 100. You have not only got your four customers, but you hit that little volume marker here. So you've earned yourself a $50 bonus, okay? That's a weekly bonus. So say you went today and you're like, I'm gonna follow up with some people and I'm gonna get my four customers. And you got that, then what happens is next Friday, you're gonna get an email that's gonna say, hey, it works deposited money into your pay portal. You can go and you can cash it out. Okay. She she already figured out how to do direct deposit. So she's already gotten one pay. You did? Oh, she already got yes. it. was still this last one, right? So for September, yeah. she got a pay. Okay. Yeah, for September for the commissions for people that we moved under her. And yeah. then to Sarah, she has also already been doing really good with like messaging me when people message her. And I know that we sent out a couple carts to some girls on the hair care line. I just don't think that they ever actually followed up with the orders, which is what a lot of us I think are running into is like, even then when we follow up, Hey, you know, like your carts expired. Hey, like if you order today, I saw that you didn't place your order, but like, if you order today, you can use this code to get a free bag of coffee. It's still just like, there's still, like everything is right there in front of them and they're wanting to order. They just don't. And okay. So kind of how to overcome that a little bit too. Cause I know that that gets pretty, I mean, I still get frustrated with it when I'm like, no. I literally sent you everything and you told me you wanted to order right now. You're like, I'm going to order. And then <laughs> everything's here and I send it to you and you can get free coffee with it or you can get free this. And it's like, yes. why are you ordering? Just click order her. And you know what? I'm going to tell you something that still happens to me that, to this day. Okay. So like that is not, I, that, and that's why I love, like I told Carly this too. Like you always want to hop on calls and hear different things because you start realizing like, this is kind of part of it. You know, like I literally had got like four people that were going to order the hair care line. Like they have their carts. Um, and it's like, they kind of fall into the witness protection program. And you're like, why are you all of a sudden like just gone? But we, we're going to talk about how to, how I like, maneuver around some of that but I want you to know like that's not you doing anything wrong um but I'm but I'll help you with that because I know that was a question that came over so I want to help even the girls that are going to get on the recording with that okay so that's awesome that you know how to do the carts right those are those are amazing um you know how to get your pay right and so that's what this unlocks your first like bonus that you can get so there's on this page you are literally going to see that there, there's four bonuses that you are able to earn that equal weekly paydays. Okay. So the $50, which is the four perks members, um, you add a distributor to that, you get a hundred dollars. And this is what we call four and a friend. So every four customers and one team member that you enroll, you get a $150 bonus. Okay. So that's your first goal. When you get that, you're going to check this little sucker. And then you literally keep doing exactly what you did when you get that first foreign friend and you're going to do it again. And then you get another 150. And then when you do three of those, you earn the builder bonus, which is 350. So I love this because you girls can earn $800 in weekly paydays before you even get your monthly commission check. And what this is doing is also this is setting you up for a commission check that is this it's an average so you would be set up for ruby and this is your goal okay so this is three people on your team and a qualified leg again this is something that we're gonna have you print off do you, do you have access to a printer yeah okay yeah i would just have to download it and then go print it out but yes we're going to get you print, printing this off, okay? And this is exactly what you do with somebody that just joins you too. So if you're like at school and they're like, wait, how are you doing this? Like, I want to be able to set my own hours and do the same thing. This is what you're going to do. And right now, what I want you to know is that if you go Ruby this month or next month, you also get an extra $500 bonus added onto this, okay? So that's not even your weekly, like that little worksheet that I just showed you, but this is also your commission check 
And then there's a $500 bonus that's also attached to that. Okay. So does this sheet make sense? Yes. Oh my gosh. The 502 bad gateway doesn't make sense, but let's be real. Okay. So you don't have any questions when it comes to this, right? No. Okay. So we will make sure that you get both of those printed off. And then here's the thing. So let's just talk about the question with when we send out carts, okay? Because that, I know that's something that people were wanting. Here's the thing. I When I do that, first of all, my first response is this. When I send out a cart, I do not let that cart sit for more than 24 hours before I check back in and I say, hey, I, I haven't seen your order come through and your cart is going to expire soon. Um, I just wanted to see if you needed more time to order or if you had questions about your order or you needed to change your order. And usually that opens it up for them to be like, hey, I can't afford it right now. Or um, is it like, could I start with a couple of products instead of the whole thing or whatever it may be? Or sometimes they're just going to say, you know, I just haven't had time to do it. And so then what it does, so I haven't said that it's expired yet because that's what I do if they still haven't ordered in a couple of days. I send to them, I'm like, hey, I just got notification that your cart expired and that's okay. I can recreate you a new one. Um, and I just say, would you want the same things? Okay. And if they say yes, I literally will go recreate a new one, even if you don't need to, or you can literally hop back in your app and you can, you can copy the same th cart that you made for them already and send it over. And then if they still haven't ordered, I'll pop back in like a few days later and I'll just say like, Hey, blah, blah, blah. Um, I know that you've been wanting to order, but I have, a, I have another question. Would you want to get entered into our cash giveaway for the month? Okay. And they're going to be like, yeah, like, what is it? You know? And so right now our cash giveaway, we are drawing two winners on November 2nd for $500 each. All they have to do for you girls to do that is literally we give them a post and you could give them, like, if they're asking, like, I try to gear it towards whatever they're about to purchase. So if it was coffee, I, like, I'm going to give them a coffee post. If it was the hair care, I'm going to give them, like, um, a post about that. And I'm like, all you have to do is either, you you guys, and here's the other thing. You might find more success in, we can create some, like, stories where they could share stories on Instagram and what they are going to do. Like, we already have it made up for them. But what they're going to do is they're going to have a little spot where they tag your handle. So people come to message you on there. So, but here's the thing. I would either have them post. And if they're willing to do that, keep it right there. Um, and more times than not, that's probably going to be on Facebook. If they don't even have a Facebook, then you're going to want to give them like an Instagram story, like a template. And you're going to say, hey, you're going to share this story and you're going to tag me in it and tell me when you're done. Come back to the comment. Tell me when you're done. And I'm going to enter you into our giveaway. And so it, what it does is it kind of opens things up, okay? So it's offering something different um, and it's it's like changing things up, but you're still sticking with them because you don't, every conversation, you guys, there are so many avenues that you can take to it without even like being pushy. Like that is one thing I want you to know. And I've told this to Carly is that one of the best compliments I swear I get, because I'm not like a, I'm not a salesy person. Like if you follow my page, you're going to see like, I'm genuine. I'm just real. Like I'm a mom. My kids are hopping in on it. Um, I usually share what I'm using for products, why I'm using it, what I love about it. And then I'll share like before and afters. And I always have like a call to action. We're going to talk about that too. So, um, but you're going to see like the one thing that I always get is like, they're like, I just love that you're not pushy. I just love that you're not salesy. And like, so anything I'm telling you, like, I just know, like I have those things in my mind. But you can still be consistent and follow up and, and you, you're you going to like get a lot of people. So I want you guys to know that if somebody doesn't like respond or order right away, it's not necessarily because they've changed their mind. And I had to learn that, but it's more so because they haven't gotten to it or maybe they checked their bank account. And here's the thing. If somebody's like, I don't really have money to get that. First of all, if you're like talking hair care line, you can be like, hey, let's just start with the Root Revival Duo. Because the truth is, is that that's a little bit less money and it's still going to get them great results. Or if they go and post for you, right. And they're getting a lot of interaction. You guys, you guys can say like, Hey, I've had five girls message me. Like, have you ever thought of doing this business? Like I know you said money was tight. You're able to make an extra $800 in weekly bonuses. You can make an extra five paydays. Like you could do this business, have your products covered that you want to use, right. Have your business covered that. 
but also make extra money. So I spin that. And you guys, I come into that stuff all the time because I have all ages joining me, college girls, all the way up to people who are like, yo, I need to work on my retirement type thing, right? And so um, know that like, that's a common thing, just even in general and even with inflation stuff. So I will kind of offer something different. And if they don't come back again, like you can wait like a week or so and be like, hey, I just, and if it's somebody that you think would be great to be on your team, or you're like, they kind of already use social media. They're like, I would actually, they would probably be good at this, like that type of thing. Ask them, be like, hey, have you ever thought about not only getting to use the products at discount, but would you be interested in making $800 in weekly paydays or a $500 bonus or whatever it works like we're offering at the time. Like that's usually what I will throw out there. And it's kind of crazy, you guys, because as you switch things up and you offer different things, you're like, they're going to eventually bite at something, right? And so, or they're going to be like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I've been meaning to, you know, um, been ordering. And at that point, you've had other conversations. And that's where I told Carly, like there's some days where I'll enroll six customers. And it's not because of my conversation I had that day. It's literally like I'm going through spending 20 minutes following up on messages just like this that we're talking about. And they're finally like, oh, okay, I'm ready to go. You know, so you, you'll you be able to spin that, but just know like I literally 24 hours after, if I've sent out a cart, I'm asking them. Like, I'm like, hey, I haven't seen your order come through. I just want to make sure that your link was working or if you needed me to answer any further questions that you came across or you needed to change anything, let me know, Okay. And then I, and then if it's, if I still don't hear anything, then I do the expired message. So I'll say like a day or two later, I'm like, Hey, your cart expired. And then I'll let them know about that. Okay. So that is how I do it. You guys, sometimes it's okay too that if they have, if they're not going to order it, like don't get stuck on waiting for people to order either. Like I keep, I make a list. Carly knows this. I am like, you guys, I'm so old school, but I am totally like a, pencil and paper kind of gal, but anybody that I have sent a cart out to, they get written down on my list so that I already know that I have sent that person out because here's the thing, even on Instagram, like you girls might be working with people, you know, right now, but as you get bold and you keep growing and you grow your network, which we'll talk about tonight, you are going to be talking to people that you don't even know. Like some of your best teammates, some of your best customers are going to be people that you don't even know yet. And so I don't remember their names. Like I'm not going to remember their handle. I don't even have brain space for that. So I literally write them down. So that way, because Instagram is weird. Like it's only, even if you try to go back through your messages it only shows you like the first 30 current and then all of a sudden it pulls up messages from like 284 weeks ago. And you're like, where did my people go? So make sure that you girls, the people that you've sent carts out to or you're having conversations with, I make a little thing that says potential PM. So it's PPM. And then I put their name down. So that way I like do not lose them. When we come out with like certain promos and stuff, if I'm looking at my map and I'm like, dang, I need, two distributors to get built in for Ruby. I go and message those people that I've already talked to even about products later. And I'm like, Hey, and I offer them the business because at the end of the day, they might be like, you have no idea what's happened even currently in their life that they might be like, okay, I've already been wanting to use the products. I'm interested in the products. People are also interested. Like I'm going to start the business, right? Or maybe you'll get them to host a post. The cool thing you guys about getting somebody to share a story or a post for you is that if they are getting interaction, that is such an easy offer to be like, hey, would you want to do this business with me? These people could either be my customers or they could be yours and you could be making a paycheck. So that is why host to post is freaking awesome. The other thing about host to post that's awesome is it has you doing your four core things. So I know Carly sent me, I think it was Shay's maybe, um, but she sent me one of the questions is they were like, just tell me exactly what to do. And I'm like, you know what? I'm here for those people because that is me. And honestly, I work off a list every single day. So um, I'm going to tell you the four core things that you are going to use for your social media. Um, this is literally what I've done from the start. You guys, I did not even use social media. I did not have Instagram. I did I did have a Facebook, but I'm not even kidding. I think I posted three total posts in all of my college years on it. And that was it. Like, so when I saw this business, I saw a friend's post and I was like, when she was like, oh, these, I don't know, I'm just sharing it on social media and people are loving the products and the before and afters and whatever else. 
So I, everything that you see from me now, just know it has been learned. It is things that I've taken and I've applied. Um, while you girls are like scrolling or you see different things, anything that caught my eye that I liked on somebody else's profile, I was like, how can I make that mine? Like, how can I make that into my, it works. Like, I love the style of that thing. I would literally screenshot it and then I'd go use our own stuff for it. So I want you to kind of think of that. Like I tell Carly all the time, like eyes and ears open all the time, all the time. Okay. Because it's crazy that as you network, how many things that you're going to be able to see you guys that you can fill gaps and serve people in different ways, whether it be through the products, whether it be through this um, business. And again, you guys, not everybody even just joins for money. Like a lot of people are looking for community. A lot of people are looking for flexibility and freedom um, for their work schedule, right? Like that's huge too. And so there's going to be a lot of things that you can share about this business that is going to catch people's eyes. Okay. So, but these are the four things that I do every single day. And then I have done now y'all, I take a day off just so you know, okay. One week, but one day out of the week. That's you're gonna see my stories are a little less on Saturdays, but that's my day that I allow myself. But you guys, when I sit down to do this, I told Carly this too. I'm like, this literally, you guys, I would say I have to always think back, right? While I was doing this when I was working full time, but I would say that I probably put in an hour total. So that's not like, oh, I sat down in a quiet office in front of my computer, which y'all might have a little more quiet time than I do, but I had babies when I started this. So, um, but it was literally like 15 minutes here, 20 minutes there, instead of scrolling that night aimlessly or whatever it was, I was like, no girl, get off your phone and freaking do your steps. Like that's literally what I thought to myself. And it's crazy because you guys, that got me to diamond in three months, which is like, a, I think it's like over two grand extra a month. So it's kind of crazy just taking that, making that decision to do that. But this is what I want to share with you. This is what I did. Okay. So this, these are what we call our four core. You will hear these over and over and over, not even just from people on our team, but from people all throughout the company. Okay. Um, is the first one is growing your network. Okay. So it is okay if your friends and family don't want to purchase from you. I promise you, even if, if it's right now that they don't want to purchase from you, they probably will eventually, but I definitely did not have friends and family purchase from me um, even till after I went diamond, which is really funny to think about. Um, but really, a lot of mine were coworkers. They're, they were like people, you guys, that I went to high school with that I hadn't talked to in years. Like I always say it paid to be a nice girl, always. <laughs> I was like, I've always been a nice girl. And listen, it paid to be a nice girl. So it was funny though, because it was like people were popping in my inbox and it came because I was posting and I was in my stories and I was sharing before and afters about the products. And it started bringing people into my message, into my inbox. Okay. So when you're growing your network, this is what I do every day. I add, I go and I follow 50 new people on Instagram. And if you're like, Sarah, where the heck do you follow these people? Y'all, does everybody follow like bloggers or people that have bigger accounts? What You, you may follow different ones than I do, okay? Um, I'm going to show you literally on here what I do. I'm actually going to see if my thing will screen share. Uh, let's see. I have phone cable. Sometimes this is like, a this is actually nice, but it's also a little annoying. Um, cause it kind of lags a little, but I do want to just show you what I do. Okay. So I will go on here. First of all, you can do it this way too. Okay. So this is just like my search page, like, and eventually as you've been on here, this thing starts serving you accounts that like cater to what you interact with. Okay. So it might take you a couple of weeks to actually get stuff that you want, but I promise you it will work. So just for instance, so these are ones that obviously have gotten a good interaction. So I could go to this gal's. And I can go to who liked her photos. I just click the other. And you guys, I will follow from stuff like this. So I could, I just do a quick thing. Look at this. I think she's, um, she's a medical assistant. So like that's somebody like that I would probably have in common with, right? She's a wife. She's a mom. She's in the medical field. So I just go and I will follow. And so this is literally what I do. Um, on some of these, I'll come from here and it might only let you add like 20 from a certain account, but you have a lot of different accounts that have like good followings and all I ever do, sometimes their, their account is private and that's fine. So you might, you might find somebody that you accidentally add and you're like, eh, she's not my people. It's okay. Like 
as you go to interact, and this is another part of our four core, you can unfollow people left and right, okay? And it's fine, like people might unfollow you, that's cool too. Like don't don't get your feels in there. Okay, that one speaks Spanish and I don't speak Spanish. So that's a no-go for me. But this is literally what I do, okay? So this is another one. She actually has like 900 some followers. That's great, right? So I will go to, and then I have like bloggers that I absolutely love. So I will go to some of their stuff and I will just, same thing. Their latest post, this is why I do some of the things I do. Their latest post, I will usually go to because here's the thing. It's recent and all of these people that are liking this are actually active on social media, right? They've just gone and liked somebody else's post. So they are active on social media. So this is why I choose from this list, okay? So, and again, I want to tell you, you don't need everybody to follow you back. You guys, I don't have like, I've done this for a long time and you're going to see, I have 6,000 followers. Like that's literally people just kind of come and go and that's fine. Like you don't need thousands and thousands of followers. It's like, I have literally done this over and over. Um, and that is in, in like the people can kind of flow in and out and that's perfectly fine. Okay. So that is how I add on Instagram. It literally takes me maybe 10 minutes to do that. Okay, so I will get up maybe a little bit early or like when I sit down to do my work, that is what I'm doing. Um, Facebook, first of all, if you're doing host a post on Facebook to let people get into your giveaway, you are already naturally going to be adding the people who are commenting that want info on whatever product your friend shared. So say you guys do the Root Revival Duo, all the people commenting, they're not going to necessarily be your friends right away. So what you're going to do first is you're going to, you're going to friend them. Then you're going to like their comment and then you're going to say messaging you info. Okay. So that is already going to have you bringing new people on Facebook. That is why host a post is awesome. It's like a system. It is calculated and it freaking works. But if you aren't doing host a post, I will also go same thing. I will go to somebody's most recent post. And you can add from their likes or let me see if it will show me on here. You know how like sometimes it will give you suggested people on there. I will go through there. And if I have people that I um, have like in common with, I will add them through that. Okay. So I will do, so I do 50 new on Instagram and 25 on Facebook daily. That's, that's my numbers. Okay. Um, the other thing that are going to grow your network is reels. If you guys are awesome at like little TikToks and stuff, um, all you have to do is you go to, or if you're like, no, I'm a reels girl, I'm a reels girl on Instagram. So I will create on Instagram. And then what I do is I'll share to all my other platforms. So you guys, you want to work smarter, not harder. So as soon as you've made it either a TikTok, a reel or whatever it is, I want you guys to save that. We go to, it's like an app called Snap Insta. Carly, have you shared that with them before? The in story? <clears throat> no, not that one. It's like, um, oh my gosh, you guys, this is so annoying. Um, let me show you on here. I don't know what, what Snap Insta is. I don't okay. think I have that one myself. You, it, and actually it's just like a website. So I'm going to show you. So say I went to this reel. I'm going to hit the little like, paper airplane. I'm going to go down here and I'm going to say copy link. Okay. So it's copied. If you go to snap insta.app, that's literally what it is. Snap insta.app. Okay. It's not even an app. Like you just go to it. I'm going to paste my real link in here and I'm going to hit download. Okay. So it brings this up. This is my real, this saves my video and my sound. So it saves all of it in one chunk. And so I hit download. That's an ad, super annoying. Okay. And then what this does is it's mine saved to my files. Your mate saved to your photos. Oh, this is another one we did. But what's awesome, you guys, is like it saved my sound. Do you see what I'm saying? So like now I don't have to go try to like create it. I literally just go share this video and the same post on my TikTok because you have different people that use TikTok. You have different people that use Instagram. And then I do it on my Facebook too. That will also grow your network because all the social media platforms are pushing like reels and those types of things out first, okay? 
So easy, easy way to do that. I want to show you something on reels too. If you're like, dang, I don't do a lot of reels. A lot of people. So like on mine. Oh, Hold on. Some of them do. Some of them will have, maybe it's not showing them. Okay, so let me go find one. Let's see if it does it. Okay, some of them will have, you guys, where it's like with the sound. See how it says use template? I can literally click on that and it's going to already, like it's gonna allow you to pop in your different pictures or videos right here and it does all the timing for you. So if you're like on a reel and you're like, I love that sound or how it does that, I will click on it like this. And if anytime it says use template, I love that because I'm like, okay, how many like squares is it? If it's five or six, I go either do my recording for that or I break it up and you can literally just plug yours into there and your reel is pretty much made. Like it pays to be a copycat. <laughs> that's like one of the best things I can tell you. So I want you to know that's also just a little hack for reels if you didn't know that, okay? So Snap Insta instantly covers your video, but also this is a super easy way. So I'm gonna give you some people that I love their content and things that just getting ideas, they're creative, um, their pages look great. Like those are things where if you see them do a reel and you're like, I could do that, you know, and I have stuff for that. Like you can literally hit use template and you can make your own reel with it. Okay. So number one is growing your network. Okay. You have to do that every single day because no matter what, even if your people are like biting at everything, that's awesome. But eventually you are going to run out of your people. Like that was something I just did not understand when I started this business. I'm like, how do you not run out of people? And they're like, you just don't because you're growing your network all the time. You are growing your network all the time. And I promise you girls, like even if you're, you like miss a few days, right? Like these are new habits that you're creating. So don't be hard on yourself. But even if you miss a few days, if you start doing this and you're like, yeah, it takes me like 10 minutes to do it. You're going to start noticing your inbox starts get hopping a lot faster. Like you're going to have more interaction on your posts. You're going to see a lot more things. You're going to start building that relationship with like complete strangers. Okay. So number two is posting and your stories. Okay. I always say you don't get paid to post, but posting and being in your stories is your only way to show that your open sign is on for your business because you have a virtual business, okay? You don't get to like pull the little light, but that is your way. You showing up in your stories and showing your face and sharing either the products or whatever it is that you want to share that day, that is turning your open sign on for your business, okay? And if you're like, Sarah, what the heck do I post? Okay, I'm going to tell you exactly what you should be posting. Um, first off, I'm sure Carly, have you shared, you shared the diamond hive tribe account with them? Yeah, okay. I did the diamond hive Instagram and then all of the girls like Jessica and Haley and yes, they're um, so good. They're yeah. so good. You guys, there are so many young girls. I tell Carly, I'm like, you're leading the next pack and I'm so proud of you girls, but I'm like, there are so many young girls that I'm like, I, I mean, I just would have died. I mean, I still die for this business. I started when I was 27, but you guys, it is a game changer, okay? But here's the thing. So posting stories. So what do you post? First of all, stories, if you are having a busy day, y'all, freaking steal the stories that we've already created. Like we share those for a reason. They are for you guys to figure out. I will show you, I am gonna share my screen and I'm gonna show you a really quick like little hack just so you know. So if you're like, well, I don't, my fingernails don't look like that. Like people will say stuff like that. I'm like, okay, okay. Like, first of all, don't sweat the small stuff, but I'm going to show you something. Um, But steal that stuff. And then I'm going to give you some stuff that you can also post. Why is that doing me to, that to me? Hold on. But like, if you see a story that you're like, okay, I want to steal that, but that's not my house or that's not this. I'm going to just steal. Okay. Say it's this one. First of all, you could just literally hold down your thumb on your screen. It takes my info and you could um, screenshot that. Some of them I purposefully do without my face and stuff in them. Okay. But if you're like Sarah shared something that I wanted to use, but it's her face, you are going to use your own cup, whatever it is. 
But what's awesome is that literally, instead of thinking, oh my gosh, I have to like go type all that out. What you can do, you screenshot that thing and then you're going to go to your photos and you are literally going to hold down on this and you can copy the text right off of any of these gals that you're following their stories, okay? And then you can take your own picture that you have recreated and I'm just going to grab a picture, any picture, let's see, we'll just do Sloan. And literally, you can go to the text and paste it on there. And it might be funky if it has like cute emojis on it. So you just might have to doctor it up a little quick second and do it exactly how you want it. But you guys do not overcomplicate. Like this is so easy. Okay, so anything that you see or want to do, like know that you can recreate and you can copy it. Okay. So here are the things that I share um, when I'm posting. I literally don't really veer from this, okay? So products, what do you post? Products that you are getting in your auto ship, right? If you're, you're like, y'all got your auto ship on, I'm freaking proud of you. Um, that is one thing that I will tell you when I see people struggling with this business, it's truly because they're not using some of the products and they haven't found the products that they love. So we all might have different products or we all might be like, hey, we're like all into the hair, we're all into the greens, we're all into the gut health, like that's awesome, right? But you wanna find the products you love, okay? So you're gonna share the products that you're using on a daily basis. You're gonna share what you love, okay? What you love about them. Why you started even using those products. Like what made you want to gravitate towards those products, okay? What it's done for you so far or like what you've noticed you guys, that is literally for most of our products, like a couple days. And you're going to already start feeling different. You're going to start noticing things. Those are things that you want to share. Okay. So what it's done for you, how do they get it? You have to tell your audience what you want them to do. Okay. Like just sharing it, they're going to be like, oh, that's cool. Like, but as soon as you start saying, message me hair for details and my discount, message me um, like gut health to get my discount or to order. Like if you start telling your people what to do, you're going to notice that they are doing what you want them to do. Okay. So you have to tell them how can they get it? Um, I share before and afters all the time. So I was telling this to Carly. I'm like, it's awesome that we can tell people what the products do or the things that I just listed. But I am telling you, if you can get your own before and afters, and we all have our before and afters, you are going to make a million dollars. Like, and that sounds so stupid, but I'm serious. I'm seriously telling you that. Like I sign 20 some customers a month just because I share over and over. I love the aloe, the greens and the coffee. And, and then I share my before and after. You guys, my before and after hasn't changed. Just the same. Like it's literally the same one I've used since I think, and I think I updated it just a little bit ago just to show people like, yes, it still works. Like you don't gain it all back or whatever. <laughs> Um, but I literally just share it in different ways. So you're going to see that over and over my hair from the root revival duo over and over and over. Every time I share my own, I literally get people that are ordering. So your own before and after is huge. If you don't have it yet, that's okay. But just make sure that you are stealing them from our group and you're putting them in there because not only do people want to know how to get the products or what the products do, but they want to see how it works. Okay. So before and afters are huge. Um, and so I want you guys to know, even if you haven't started products, what are your, like, what do you want to get? I want you to go on that website, your website, and I want you to see what are three to four products that you're like, I'm so interested in this. Or you can even tell Carly, be like, these are the things that I kind of want to focus on. What products should I start with? You can even ask me that. Um, because I started this business and I didn't, I hadn't used any products. Like I was wanting to order. And then I literally had somebody say, Hey, Sarah, you can use these products at discount, but you could also make extra income sharing them. Would you like to do that? And I was like, sign me up, sign me up. And that's literally where it all started, okay? So that's what we do when we're posting about products. Those are the things that are going to bring you in those perks members and get you those four and then the friend, okay? We're gonna talk about the friend, getting your team members, okay? But that is what I do over and over. I will, I obviously like, products. And so I use a bunch of them. So I, sometimes you guys, it's the same thing. 
And it's just a different way of sharing it. Sometimes I'm in my stories and I'm making it and it's just to music. Sometimes you might see just like a pre-made story that I've made. Sometimes I'm talking on it. Like you can share the same thing so many different ways, okay? And then the other thing is that I want you guys to know that do you, in your settings on Instagram, first of all, you want your Instagram linked to your Facebook. So even if you don't use Facebook, that's okay a lot but you're still going to have people on Facebook that see your stuff. So that way, every time I post on Instagram, it goes over to my Facebook. I don't even have to think about it. Okay. So you want to make sure your stuff is linked. Second is you want to make sure your archives are on you guys, as you create, there might be a day that you have a little more time, right? Than, than the other day. When I create stories, I know it's not just for that day. So in the beginning, it might take you a little bit. You're going to be like, dang, that took me a ridiculous amount of time to make my story. That's okay. Okay. You are going to get faster. You are going to get more efficient. But what I do on days that I already know I'm going to be like super busy or I'm not going to be in there, I will go back like to my stories from no, like a couple months ago or even like a month ago. And you guys, I literally will save them. And I will post the same thing. So people are not going to remember. So once you've made stories and they're here, you can literally go grab them. So like this one, I can literally go post that today. And people are not going to remember that I shared this on September 12th. So the things that you're making is also going to be things that you can use consistently over and over and over again. Okay. So I just wanted to make sure that you guys have your archives on because that is just like a game changer. Again, like I will teach you every hack I have learned to work smarter, not harder um, with all of this. So, and then, so we got through that, right? And then, then we're talking about business. So for business, things that you're going to share is why you joined, what you started for, right? I asked you that in the beginning of this, like, you know, your number. Sometimes it's $200, sometimes it's $300, sometimes it's $500. Um, I will tell you more times than not, most people are like in the 300 to 600 range. With inflation, people are getting a little bit more bold. They're like, I want $800 extra a month. I'm like, good for you, let's do it. So you wanna share why you joined, what you started for. So you can say, you don't have to say your number to them, but you can say, I wanted extra income and the ability to do that on my own time. Like I needed the flexibility due to my school schedule or my sports schedule or whatever. When you share that stuff, people are, they're like relating to that. They're like, dude, my school schedule psycho. Like I need something way more flexible. Like that would help me so much. Right. So you kind of get a little vulnerable of why you're doing those things. Um, what you are headed for. This is so important. And so you, it's crazy, you guys, but you don't even have had to reach your goal yet to speak where you're headed. And when you speak where you're headed, people want to join people who know where they're going, plain and simple. So if you get off of the sales and you're like, I'm going for a $500 bonus, like I'm so freaking excited. And I love that I can earn weekly bonuses on the way to earning that. Like people are gonna be like, wait, what? Weekly paydays, a $500 bonus? Like that's a lot of money for people, right? And they're gonna be like, what are you doing? They're going to start asking questions. So you want to know where you're headed, what your goal is, but you want to start sharing that. Guess what? People don't pay attention if your goal is the same the next month. They just know. Elsa knows where she wants to go. Carly knows exactly where she's going and she's working for it every single day. And I see her showing up every single day. Those are the people that want to join. They want to join the people that they're like, they're not going to flake out. They're consistent. If I join them, they're still doing it. Like they're looking for those things. Okay. So, and then you want to say um, what you love about the business already, right? And you might be in a short amount of time, but you might be like, I absolutely love the vision that our company has. I love that they offer bonuses. I love that they value people's time by giving us the flexibility and the freedom. I love that I can earn bonuses. I love that I can give myself a pay raise every single month if I want to go for it. Like you can list the things that this business offers that you're like, this is why I love this, right? And then you want to share with them how you, how to join you. And I can break these things down and I'll send them to Carly so you guys can like have them. But those are literally what I go through when I'm sharing the business. Another thing, 
is I will share behind the scenes. So as you start enrolling those and you get those little notifications, Elsa, where it's like, you just got a Perks member. You want to screenshot that. Like you're going to screenshot that. And then in one of the days you can be like, I'm literally walking back from class. And maybe you have a couple of those little notifications. You screenshot your view and you can be like, I absolutely love that I can work from anywhere at any time. Like I am so grateful for the ability to do that. And you share like your little notifications and people are like, what it starts doing is it's kind of telling your story, but it shows people like they know you, right? They know you're busy. They know you're going to school. They know that you're in sports. They know that you're working. Like they know those things and they're like, oh my gosh, like how amazing. Like I want to be able to do that, right? So it kind of starts bringing people in and it shows them that it's, we are just girls that decided to kind of go for it is really what it is. And so um, those are the things that I share about the business and I share like little behind the scenes things, things when we do this, or you hop on a call, I'll do like a little boomerang. And for like a story, oh, actually, I, I need to do that. I was just thinking, I know, Brooke, I got off. Hello, I was work, like, it. Hello work it Wednesday. Brooke <laughs> just texted me. She had to go back to homework. So that's why that's okay. she walked off, but. but but we can do one. So like, we'll do a boomerang and it's something as simple as saying like, I'm so excited. I'm adding an extra five paydays to my month and running. You could say for $1,300 in bonuses, right? That's like, it. if you're like, where'd you get that number? It's that little worksheet where you can earn 800. But also if you're going Ruby, you have the 500. Do you think that you guys know people who would like to make an extra $1,300 a month? Just like every college student mm -hmm. known to me. Like man, every honestly. human. Like <laughs> every person that, like every single Everyone person knows. off the top of my head would be like, yeah, I would love to make that extra month. Every single person I know. That's what I'm saying. So you just have to get loud. And you know what? You don't need every single person to join you or to work as hard as you or to do the things. You just need the right ones. Like that's it. And you're not, you don't know that. They're going to figure out themselves if they're the right one. But I am telling you, like not everybody I've messaged or everybody that I sent cards out to has actually done anything with it, but the right ones have. And I've stayed consistent in doing my core four. Like that is it. So like stay true to the process, but I'm just giving you guys some ideas, like super easy. Like you literally are learning how to build your business from your phone. People are on their phones a ridiculous amount. Like people that I told Carly, I go, I go home sometimes in people who do not work off their phone are on their phone way more than even I am. And I'm like, I run a six figure business off my phone. And I'm like, it's crazy. So people can't tell me like, well, I don't want to stare at my phone. Well, you already are actually, and you're doing nothing with it. So even just sh sharing that, like, go check, like, there's a story, I think thread that we have that says like, go check how much time you spend on social media. And it's like, would you like to actually monetize that time? right? Would you like to turn your scroll into income, right? And so you guys can do those things. And then everything that I do on a story, you are going to see I have a call to action. And if you're like, what the heck is that? It means I'm putting on a poll where they can vote that says like, yes, I'm interested or send me more info. Anytime you're doing that, it is always a yes and yes. We don't care about the people. We, we aren't going to do yes, no. Like we don't even care about the people who say no. Okay. They're just going to scroll on by any, anyways. We are focused on the ones who are interested, right? So it's always a yes and yes, but you are going to see, I always have a call to action. And what that is, is it's telling my audience and my viewers what to do to get the info, what to do to get the details of joining my team, what to do to figure out how to order. So that way they know exactly what to do and there's no question. If I just post without giving that stuff, I get very few people popping in my inbox. But if I actually tell them what to do, you start seeing like you're gonna get texts, you're gonna get like little different things, you're gonna get messages, you're gonna see them voting. Um, so you wanna make sure you have that call to action. Another easy thing to post you guys always is like positive mindset stuff. Um, you will find accounts like we share on the Diamond Hive, a lot of the accounts there. As you start following them, you'll start seeing their stuff more. But honestly, you can go on Pinterest. I mean, that, that's something really easy to share on Facebook too. But it's something that other people start sharing. And again, that goes back to number one, where it like grows your network. It's going to bring people over. But the truth is, is like people are so negative in this world that you just even being positive are going to stand out a lot. Okay. And they'll come back to your page for that. Um. As you're doing social media, 
it's not the only way to build this business, but it is going to bring conversation to you as you're in person with people. So as you guys go out, as you guys are doing different things, you're working or whatever it is, people are going to be like, Hey, I saw your stuff. Like I've saw, I've seen you post about the simply aloe. Like I have the worst bloating. I have such bad energy. Like, can you tell me more about that? So know that what we do on social media is kind of like a open sign and a segue to when you're in person, people will start asking you. So it's not that I don't like talk to people in person because I do, but it's kind of nice because I've already drawn them into myself. Like I don't have to go start up that conversation with them. Um, number three is messaging. You got a message. So um, whether you're bringing people in with number one and two and you're bringing them into your messages, but I'm going to show you what I also do for messaging. Carly is so good at messaging. Um, it's crazy, Carly, to think that you built what you have mostly off of messaging and stories and interacting. Like you don't yeah. even do a ton of posts. Like that's, what's kind of crazy. But what's cool too, is that as you grow, you can start posting. So yeah. it just kind of shows like those types of things, but messaging is huge. Carly's really good at it. Um, the thing is, is doing host to post, it brings you people to message and people who are already interested Having call to actions in your stories should have your messengers start popping. Um, as we do number four, so number four is interacting, okay? You have to put out what you want, okay? I always say this. So if you want people to be interacting on your stories, interacting on your posts, all that kind of stuff, you have to go put that out. So I literally set a timer or I will do, I will count um, and I will set a timer and I will go through and I will scroll through my Instagram and instead of just harding on things, like we all do that, right? Where you just give the little like, anytime you think to yourself, I'm going to like that. I want you to go comment. Okay. Cause there's a reason for that. First of all, it's going to bump your stuff up in the algorithm to be seen more. Second of all, people follow comments and you'll randomly get followers that way anyways. And you guys, it's not the amount of followers, but your goal is to bring new eyes to your page. And your page is already going to have posts, it's going to have stories. And that's when people see like, what is this hair thing? What is this gut health thing? Those are two like trending big time right now is gut health and um, hair stuff. Okay. People are like, I, I actually didn't even realize how many people struggled with their hair until I started posting about our hair care. So, um, but those are two big ones. So if you're like, where do I start? I would tell you to start there. Okay. Is gut health and the hair stuff. Um, but I will go through and what interacting does is it builds that relationship with total strangers. Like you may not know that, but you literally can make somebody that you don't know that just started following you a friend within like three days. I'm not um, even kidding. Actually, this literally just happened to me. I found this girl on TikTok and I started following her yes. and then I found out that she actually goes to Arizona state. And then I started following her on Instagram and a lot of our content was like, the same thing and um now we snapchat like every day and i'm trying to get her to be a customer or a business partner as well as my friend and so um and i message random people like i have no idea like i see someone pop up on my for you page about like this one girl that i had messaged she was like i'm gonna have to get a fifth job because i can't keep like i can't keep up with my concert ticket addiction and I slid in and I said, hey, I don't know if you were joking about having a fifth job, but like, if you are looking for something to like monetize your time with, since you're already posting content anyway, like I have this opportunity for you. And she was like, no, I actually really wasn't joking about getting a fifth job. Like this could be something really crazy and change a lot of things for me. Yeah. And so like, honestly, like so I understand that it gets like intimidating to message people. But like once you just like, I probably sent out like 20 messages on TikTok to girls that I've never talked to before in my life. And like three of them replied and wanted to do orders or, you know, one of them replied and wanted to do the business. And so it's just like the worst thing that they can say is not anything at all and open it or no. And so, but if you don't plant those seeds in general, like the first time around, you know, cause then they'll be thinking like, oh, you know, like this one girl messaged me one time about making money from her phone. Like, I wonder if that's still an option. And then like, they come back to your page. Yes. And like, I posted <clears throat> um, a few videos of my sister and they went like super, super viral because um, she's hilarious. And like in between those posts, because I would, I would look at my TikTok page and it tells you how many people came. And I had like thousands and thousands of people looking at my page a day. So then I took that 
and I posted like a couple random TikToks about it works or like the gut health or like, you know, like my aloe like transformation, like what it's done for me or, you know, like monetizing off your social media. So then like, even if people are just looking through your page and they're not interacting on anything, they're still seeing it. Mm -hmm. And, And it's important. Like I want all you girls to continue to post what you did even before it works. Like it works as a small piece of your life now, but um, and, and I, I don't mean like, it's not going to be big, but I just mean like, you are a lot of other things, right? Like you're a student, you're working, you're an athlete, like you're all like all these things, like you still want to share all those things because those things is what relates you to other people. Like, and then what's cool is as they relate to you, they start seeing themselves and the things you do because you're operating and you're like, anybody can do this. And it's true. They can, you guys, like I've literally if you've seen the stories I've watched, it's kind of insane. But so interacting is huge. I pick 25 accounts. I will inter- I comment on them. The other thing that I do is I will choose also not just to go on people's posts, but you know how like you have your story threads all the way at the, up at the top. I will scroll through and I comment on stories because it pops you in their inbox. And I'm telling you, as you do that, you start seeing that people are going to start doing the same thing to you. And as you open that inbox up and that wave of communication, people will start messaging you about products. And you're going to be like, I just had my first random. And you're going to be like, I loved it. It was the easiest customer I've ever gotten out of anybody. Like, I remember I was so butthurt my family wasn't purchasing from me. And then I remember I finally signed my aunt up. You guys, she was the biggest pain in my butt compared to everybody else that I was like, I don't even want my family. Like you stay over there, I'm over here. And now they, I mean, they all order and they use the products and different things. But I just want you to know, like your strangers are gonna be some of your favorite people. But I do comment in stories. So I take time to interact. Um, And then self-development. It's just knowing you guys, you are going to earn as you learn. Like it's okay that you aren't exactly where you wanna be or your posts don't look like this or your stories don't look a certain way. And really, if you want to know something, just ask. Like, if you guys saw the amount of questions that I ask, even like bloggers, <laughs> how they do stuff, you would be like, go, Sarah, like you have balls, right? But it's true. Like, I have literally learned everything that I've that you see. So plugging into the calls, like the Monday night calls are so big because you are going to hear so many different stories, but it also shows you how capable of this business that you truly are, but also what this business can do for your life. So like, Self-development's the fifth thing. So, but your first four are growing your network, posting in stories. Three is messaging. That includes follow-ups. Follow-ups are real quick, you guys, real quick. And I can help all of you guys with that. But my follow-ups, I will send out 30 follow-ups in like seven minutes. Um, so they're short, sweet. I don't get caught up on them, but follow-ups, you will you will sign a lot of people. You're not being annoying. Most people are actually very appreciative of it. And they're like, thank you for not forgetting about me. Or they're like, I'm so sorry it took me so long. No, it's okay, right? Um, But then four is interacting, which builds that relationship. So I just pick people that I comment on and I comment on their stories. And then five is doing stuff like this, okay? The last thing I wanna share with you is that in this business, like copy the people who are doing what you wanna do or who are where you want to be. Because I'm gonna tell you, we didn't have Zoom. You guys, we didn't have boards. We didn't have people doing stories for us. Like my posts were terrible. Like when I go back and I look like aesthetically, they're terrible. Um, what I shared was terrible. Like it was just short. I didn't know enough, like whatever, but I just want to tell you like copy the right cat. So find your people. So I gave Carly probably has given you some of these people, but I gave you, I wanted to put in the chat. Wow. If I can even copy this, I gave you four people that I thought I love their Instagrams. Oh my gosh. Okay. This one's just like not working. Hold on. Um, all right. This doesn't want me to copy it. Anyways, I'm going to send them to Carly because I have the links. Okay. But I sent you four people on Facebook and there's four people on Instagram that I think are awesome. Y'all can follow me. You can steal any of my crap, any time of the day, please like hop in my inbox or if you're like Sarah how the heck did you just do this story like send it in my inbox Carly knows like I am answering questions all the time and I I love that like I love getting to work alongside you guys I love you guys learning growing and the only way to do that is to ask questions but I like my goal has never been when I started this business is just for me now 
Like our team is amazing. They are awesome. You girls can make so much money doing this and in the pockets of your day. And I'm telling you that freedom and flexibility that you can earn from it is like a game changer. Even if you do it, like you just are going to open so many doors for yourself, even when your real job comes and all the things. So um, I'm just proud of you guys for getting going as early as you have, because I'm, that's having a very good vision for yourself. So um, Elsa, does that help? Yes, a lot. Yes, a lot. Okay, it gives you a place to start, right? And then from there, it's like we can fine tune things. Um, mm -hmm. And again, Carly, the girls that were going to be on here, like I, you can put me in a message with all of them if, it, if that's helpful to them. Um, and that way, you know, if Carly can't answer or she's in class, like my inbox, my text is always open. We will get to you. We will help you with everything. So, um, but that, like, honestly, what's crazy is that is literally what I do and have done for like, 11 plus years to get to where even where I'm at. So um, it just takes consistency and some time and you're going to see that you're going to start gaining your momentum and you're going to be like, yeah, this is awesome. Okay. So um, any questions that or things that I didn't go over tonight that you were like, no, I had this question and I want to ask it. No, it was totally answered. Yeah, you got it. And I Carly, I think I got and I answered the questions that you sent me over to. So even the girls that can get the recording, they should be able to have that too. Or is there any that you, that you, I haven't answered? No, it was just Elsa's, um, you know, like getting people to your website. Oh, yes. No, that was so good. Okay. So here's what I want to tell you guys about that. You guys, nobody, I shouldn't say nobody, you may have a very rare person. Like, you know how we can share our links to anything right on Instagram. Now you don't mm -hmm. have to have 10,000 followers, but I am going to tell you the way that you get people to actually go to your website or click on things is to have a conversation. I have never just randomly posted my website up and had somebody join my team or had somebody just go on and order. And if they do, they probably end up ordering retail, which is not what you want anyways. That's not what you want. You don't earn bonuses off of retail customers. You don't get them ordering multiple months in a, in a row. Like you, you truly, there's no shortcut. Like you want to have that conversation. And I'm telling you, there is money in the conversations, right? I always say like, if you can have that conversation, your rate of conversion to a perks member or a distributor is so much higher. So truly out of all those four cores that I do, my goal Elsa is to have them in my inbox. And then as soon as they say that they want to order, what I tell my people is I say, okay, and these are complete strangers, y'all. Like I literally work with complete strangers right now. I've been in this business for a long time. So um, what I tell them is I say, hey, perfect. I'm going to go create your um, customized shopping cart for you. Please send me over your number because I'm going to text it to you. I get numbers all the time. Okay, so I convert them to text because that is where I'm going to see things first anyway. Okay, so that way I have their number too. And you guys, if you're like, do people think that's weird? Nobody's ever, ever in my life have they told me that that's weird. They literally hand me over their phone number and then I text them and I say, hey, Kayla, this is Sarah from Instagram. I have your um your direct cart link and I'm going to put it below. All you have to do is click the picture and it's going to prompt you through and walk you through how to ordering. So it's going to fill your cart and I just let them know what it's going to look like. Right. And then it's done. Like they order. So I never like very few times do I just send somebody my website unless they're like, Hey, can I see the website to see what else you have? Absolutely. But that is still through a text message. So you want to have that conversation. Okay. You want to have the conversation. That is where you are going to get your highest conversion ever. Even since Instagram allowed us to post our website links, I still don't get people who, I never just roll up into my E-suite and I'm like, oh, wow, I have five random customers. Every customer I'm signing, it's somebody that I've talked to. I've given them info on how to get the discount or I've given them, answered their questions on the products or they've shared with me like, hey, this is what I want to focus on. Which products do I need to use type thing? So um, if you, like, I think that was such a great question because I also thought the same thing for a while, but I'm like, no, it's, it's just a little bit different than what you kind of see bloggers do. But I also will tell you, if you get in that conversation, you're going to have so much more control over the amount of sales that you make. So that was also kind of something I loved because you guys, I have like a like to know it and stuff. And it's like, you have zero control over that, right? If like people are going to click or going to do this stuff, if you actually pull them into that conversation, you have about 75% more control over where that's going to go 
than if you just throw up your website 24 seven. So that was a great question. I think that was it, huh, Carly? I think so, yeah. Yeah? You covered okay. them really well. You were on fire tonight, Sarah. Oh, well, you're welcome. I mean, I do do this on a daily basis. I was like, listen, if there's one thing that, you know, when they say like, what's one thing that you could talk about for like an hour straight without even like just needing anything? I'm like, um, it's this business actually. That's what it would be. But okay, if you, as you guys think of other questions, send them over my way. But Elsa, let's go get you your first $150 bonus because I'm excited for you. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're welcome. Bye Elsa. Bye guys. I'll see you later. Bye.